<clears throat> Nails in my feet. I gotta tell you, life sucks as a puppet. I mean, cartoon characters got it easy. They don't have to deal with five-fingered monsters crawling all over them or being nailed to the floor. Or dying. I was talking with old Scoopster the other day. Once you get past the doggy speak, he's pretty clear. He says the studios cut sweet package deals for cartoons. They get television shows, feature films. I know, I know. I've had my day. I made the majors and got my feature film, Ruling the Valley Time Forgot. Only now I'm in the closet that Time Forgot. Whoopee, I'm Colossosaurus Rex. Tyrant of the closet. My big feature was a one-time gig. Not like a cartoon character with spin-offs and trading cards and lunchboxes. Sure, I was big then. But now it shows once a week on some cable network. And only the geeks living in their mother's basement stay up to watch me. It's nothing compared to what a cartoon character gets. Oh no! Cartoons have immortality staring at them. A yeah, cartoon has all those animation cells. Thousands of them to hold their life together. Some of those, those guys wind up in museums, even. Talk about immortality. Then there are guys like me. Sure, I was a star. But what happened to me after filming ended? They stuck me on a shelf. Which, I gotta admit, is better than some folks I know who went straight into the garbage. You should have seen me. Ripping into the other dinosaurs and dominating the frame while our handlers blurred all around us. I remember the light heating up my skin all the way down to the metal bones inside me. And I was good. I could move one tiny frame at a time and hold that pose while they got the lighting redder. No matter how long it took them, I'd always remember my role. I was the Tyrant King. Now look at me, sitting on the same shelf till dust covers me so thick you can't even tell what color I was. Hooker's green with a yellow oxide underpaint for those curious types. <laughs> Man, I'd give anything to have one more day on stage. But that would kill me faster than anything. Why? They built me out of foam latex. Do you know what the lifespan on foam is? Five years, if you're lucky. I've been sitting here for over 50 years. I mean, my foam oxidized years ago. It doesn't show and I I'm trying to keep it together. But one of these days, someone's going to try to lift me off the shelf, and their hands will punch right through to the armature inside me. I'll crumble to dust before they even finish moving. It gives me the willies. It scares me. You know the saying, they broke the mold when they made him? Yeah. Well, that's mondo true for me. I can't just get a new body and be ready to go on. I don't have another cell of animation waiting to take over. If I move, that's it. Show's over. If I were a cartoon character, heck, if I were a real dinosaur, they'd put my armature in a museum. But not me. Not a puppet. There's no immortality in my future. Touch me, and I'm dead. Mm. Oh.